Hello and welcome to my channel. This reading is for those of you that have strongly Capricorn in your chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and Jupiter for March 2022. Please have in mind that this is a general reading, so the messages that will come through may or may not resonate with you. If you are interested in a personal reading, all the information you need is down there below in the description box. Okay, Capricorn, let's see. Capricorn. Silence. Someone is not talking. This person that is not talking, that is not expressing, um, is going through a battle, an internal battle. I'm also hearing give each other space, or you're giving each other space. There is a decision that needs to, to, to take place here. A decision. Capricorn, when it comes to love with the Ace of Cups. Mm -hmm. Capricorn. Two more shuffles, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter for March 2022 for Capricorn, please. For Capricorn. Are we ready? One more. Yeah, we, we, I'm seeing the King of Swords here again. This is um, regarding communication. Uh, I feel that someone is not speaking their truth. They're holding back. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. See the King of Swords. Let's see. And on the bottom of the deck, we have Earth energy, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. This is your energy, Capricorn. Again, you are standing in, you're standing in your power. You are standing in your truth, which is very interesting. So I feel that this is the person or the people that you're dealing with. Someone here is juggling. Leo Sagittarius Aries. This king is juggling. Is juggling decision. This is very interesting. Um, so, oh my goodness. I really need to see this. Because we have the... Nine of Pentacles. No, she's a single energy. We have the Emperor here. Masculine energy. Now, it could be that this masculine energy is desi desiring to, 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 to become single. Or stay single. But then again, he's offering a cup. So it could be this person has freed themselves from uh, someone. Now they're single. Coming towards the Empress. You see that? So this emperor is coming towards the empress, wants to come towards the empress and bring in a, a change, a bring in transformation. I feel that this emperor is really interested in, in making things work, for things to start rolling, to start, you see the fool, this is like starting something new, taking that risk. Again, we have the Hermit energy here, which is a single energy. Um, I feel that this masculine, this, this Emperor is guided to take this risk with his Empress. But it does require for him to make this decision, right? Now, it could be that this decision is yours of accepting this offer from this Emperor um, or not. Even though you have been waiting for this transformation, you have been waiting for this change. It, it, it may have taken a lot of time for this to come in and maybe you have moved forward, um, uh, Capricorn. Again, someone here is taking um, action. Mm 
rushing. Could be that this decision is yours, as I said earlier, because um, you're juggling. You see, the Capricorn here is juggling. Not sure if this is the right choice, if this is the right person. Hmm. So first card for you, you're confused. Okay, I get it. You're confused. Or it could be that you do have options now. Maybe now you have options. Hmm. Ten of Pentacles. Like, is this the right choice? Is this the right cup? Should I accept or not? Is this, will this connection, will this person be um, a plus in my life? You're doubting here. Is, is, I feel that this is your choice, Capricorn. Mm. Six of Cups, soulmate energy. Could this be someone from the past? Yes, but it could also be someone new. Someone that you feel comfortable with. Someone that brings you chills, like in a good way, or butterflies in your stomach. Could be. Ace of Wands. Now, this is um, a phallic symbol. It could be that you are very attracted um, sexually. You are sexually attracted to this person, or this person is sexually attracted to you, but this is not enough. You want more, you are desiring more. Maybe this is what you are um, fighting off, uh, a connection or a, a connection that um, is, is like... only about that sexual attraction just saying mm -hmm. three of swords you're not interested in connections that are like uh, friends with benefit connections or um how do you say that situationships <laughs> is that correct is that, i don't know i just heard that so mm-hmm there's also the fear of uh, fear here of, 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 of getting hurt. Maybe this person did hurt you and you're like, I don't know if I'm going to open the door or, or I don't know. The high priestess. Again, I'm getting that silent, silent energy. You're not talking. You're not expressing. You do have your doubts when it comes to this connection, this person. There is offers coming towards you, okay? There are offers coming towards you. Okay. New opportunities. I mean, you do want a, 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 a plant and you see you are looking forward to that but you're not just like i don't know if i should plant it here or there you have options as, as i said earlier you do have options should i give this a chance is this really worth it? Or am I just, I'm hearing opening a can of worms. I don't know what that is, okay? Sorry, I don't know. I'm also picking up that you have been like uh, encountering meeting soulmates the past like, maybe three, four or five years, and it's like all about lessons, 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 and you're tired of the lessons, you know, you're like, oh, is this a lesson again? Okay, okay. Capricorn, let's see. Purifying the Seven of Cups for Capricorn. The Four of Swords, you have healed. You have done a lot of work. 
you have healed it through your sword. Mm. You did find you did find your happiness again, your confidence, and you're like, okay, is this person gonna break me? I'm not thinking that you're going to allow that. And again, maybe feelings are running high. Maybe as I said earlier, the sexual attraction is very like strong, and you're like, ugh, I don't know. I don't know. So it could be also that you are keeping that, um, you're keeping, like, you're not speaking, you're silent, um, trying, like, to really, like, assess this offer or opportunity. And again, this could be also regarding career. It could be, or, 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 um, or an offer, just an offer is on the table and you're like, I don't know. Could be about purchasing something or selling something or starting a new business or collaborating, moving. Because you you are you are on a journey here. It could also it could also be that like yeah like sorry like needing to make a choice when it comes to a specific path and you are a bit confused like which way to go. Like I know that this is not what I want. This is not, this is not giving me. Um, it's not giving me what I want, and uh, it's like which way should I go? Which which is the right path for me? That will not bring the satisfaction or or pain. Yes. I mean, you are aiming for the Ten of Pentacles, which is abundance, prosperity, growth. That is your goal for Capricorn. We have the Page of Pentacles. Now, the Page of Pentacles is that fresh energy. It's also about being a student, learning something new. This is a very fresh energy, and he, he is holding... This page of pentacles is holding the ace of pentacles. Now this is that that start, the new start, the new the the, the fresh right, the, the the seed that you are holding in your hand, and you as I said earlier, you are not like you don't know where where to plant the seed. Where is the right place to do that? The, yes. Is this going to be fruitful? Is this going to grow? Is this the right person? Is this the right job? Is this the right home? Is this the right... Even like country I'm hearing. So I don't know if you are considering moving, traveling, could be. Also letting go of a familiar, familiar energies, like also leaving home. I'm hearing also leaving behind like family, friends, like something that is like familiar to you in order to get this new start. Okay, for Capricorn. We have the Nine of Pentacles. This is a very, it's, it's promising. This has, from what I'm seeing now, it will have a good outcome, so don't doubt. It, it came it came into your awareness for a reason it came towards you for a reason and even though you are confused at this time this is the right thing this is the right path it's like your ships are coming in you deserve this you have been manifesting this while you were healing, while you were meditating, Capricorn. I'm also hearing that a lot of um, 
people, energies, places are, are, are just cycling out from your life. Whatever needs to go will go to make room for what is meant to come. You're going to be victorious. Okay? So again, don't doubt. This is the right path. Okay? Ace of Wands for Capricorn. We have Leo Energy, the Strength card. It does require a lot of strength to start something new because there is that, 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 that taking a risk, you know, uh, not knowing the outcome, also taming that fear of failure, taming that fear of, of, of getting hurt again or disappointed or not getting what you want because your ships are coming in, okay? And it was about time. You are wounded. You are wounded. You are doubting. Sorry if I'm repeating, okay? And this is not for all of you. And you're like, I don't know, this sounds too good to be true. Why now? Why this and why that? But you are strong, Capricorn. You're very strong. From what I'm seeing here, you are going to give this a chance. Whatever this is to you, whatever this means to you, you are going to give this a chance. You are wiser, stronger than you were in the past. Again, I'm seeing that you are you are being offered something here. You are being offered something. But you're not trusting it. Okay, you're not trusting this. Listen, you have your reasons, but yeah. You're not trusting it. So I'm also hearing don't put all your eggs in one basket. So maybe doing that will make you feel better or will make you like be more confident of, 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 about taking this leap of faith or choosing this path. You're going to go, okay, you know, I'll give it a chance. I'll try it. But then again, you always have a backup because you're not trusting it. You're not trusting it at all. At all I'm seeing here. And I, I really hope that fear is not blocking this. Just, just your fear. Because I'm seeing victory. And justice. For Capricorn. That is your energy. We have the King of Pentacles. Again, you're very determined um, to get what you want. Get what you want. Go where you where you where you want. Oh my goodness! Yes, as I say that, we have the Eight of Pentacles. You are very determined to get where you want to go, and nothing is going to stop you. So you need to trust yourself. You need to trust yourself. Along the way, yes, you will. There, there are bumps and on the road, on the road, and you're going to meet people that are not, you know, transparent or genuine or whatever, you know. Uh, but. Uh, you know, not trusting them, stopping you is not, you know, you should trust yourself because I said you are wiser and stronger now. So trickers, 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 trick or treat, oh, trickers, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> trick or treat. No one can trick you here. This, is, this, this could be why you are silent. You are in that um, high priestess energy.
not wanting to rush things or make like um like decision that is going to any kind of decision that is going to be like rushed or 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 yeah or w without um without um the the right the right amount of information you're juggling again i'm seeing that two of pentacles okay you're not sure here okay so you're al you're allowing time you're giving space for, for things to come to light for things to get more like clear hmm, before you make the final decision which is not bad not at all okay capricorn Again, there is something that is being offered to you. This could be also friendship I'm hearing or a romantic kind of uh, offer here. Maybe this is a date. Someone wants to date you or see you or catch up with you. But again, you have a sense that this this Knight of Cups is in this uh, is a Seven of Swords ener energy disguised in the Knight of Cups. Mm. This could be someone that uh, again I'm getting that uh, for a couple of you this could be a, f a friend, could be a friend. Mm. Could be a friend that maybe you 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 uh, were like sexually attracted to and things never really like moved forward maybe you are also working with this person this is also what i'm hearing that maybe you are working with this person but you will you will get your you would get your clarity with the hanged man Again, this is an energy of stillness, of a pause, of, of, of slowing things down or not rushing things to get your answers. And you will get your answers. You will. For Capricorn. Yeah, you're more about... What I'm seeing here is more you being more and, and, and ready and open for, for new people, for new energies. So if there is someone from the past that wants to re-enter or someone that really is not putting effort or energy or is like, mm -hmm, you're not really like interested here. I'm not seeing that you are interested. You're like, I don't know. I don't know. Ooh, ooh. So, yeah. Clarifying the Ace of Pentacles for Capricorn here. For Capricorn, the Ace of Pentacles for Capricorn, please. We have the Three of Pentacles. Now, again, this, this could be um, a message regarding uh, your career and your finances and your growth maybe also someone is promising you that yeah you know um, so, like we'll give you that promotion next year or in a couple of months um but you, i don't know or, or let's say you are in, 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 in an environment, in, in, in a new, it could be a new job, or it could be an existing job, and you're like, okay, I need, I, I want a raise, or I want a better position, or, you know, and, and the, like, the little, like, sorry. <laughs> it's like people promising you things, and you're like, I don't know. You're more viewing this like empty promises. Or not trusting, you're not trusting what they are promising you. So. One more for Capricorn. Ace of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles for Capricorn. 
a choice. The lovers is a choice again, so. Yeah, you see, you fear that there's something hidden. There is a hidden agenda, you're fearing that. Mm. So, again, with the lovers and the moon, um, again, the advice here is to take things slow, not really, like, reject or not rejecting, but also not being with open, like, arms about it and jumping from joy you're just like i'm gonna see we'll see we'll see i'll sleep on it we'll see yeah this is the vibe of picking up okay for capricorn one last card for capricorn because you don't want in any way or form to go back you're you just want to move forward you want to grow. You want to expand. You're in for the new. You're, 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 in, you're in with... You're not going back there. You see what I mean? You're not going back there. No, no, no. So that's why you're cautious here. But it's not, it's not bad. Not bad at all. Because mm -hmm. you are in your power with the Queen of Wands here. You're not going back there. You're not going back there. No, no, no. You have walked away from this. You have walked away from this. There's only a success in front of you. Okay? So let's see what's the advice. Your general advice for March. And then your spiritual message for March, Capricorn. Okay? Let's see. Capricorn. Accept compliments. Okay, but I'm, but I'm gonna pick one more for you from this deck. For Capricorn, thank you. And for your spiritual message for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter, Capricorn for March, spiritual message for March, Capricorn, please. Thank you, Spirit. So we have accept compliments. The next time someone gives you a compliment, say thank you. Don't shrug it off, play it down, or reject the gift. You'll be denying yourself and the giver the opportunity to share in a moment of gratitude and love. Exercise your self-esteem and soak it in, superstar. Think of, think of compliments as little confidence-building soul vitamins. You are worthy of praise. Okay. Tell the truth. Communicate with integrity. You may need to level with someone. This person could even be you. Are you saying you're fine when you don't mean it? Are you swallowing your needs because you don't want to rock the boat? When we hide the truth, it eventually comes out in destructive ways. Act with integrity and say what's on your mind, while honesty may lead to short-term discomfort. You, your long-term peace and happiness are worth it. And I did say, and I keep, I was keep saying that you are silent. You're not speaking, um, Capricorn. Okay, so I don't know. Maybe yeah, you, know, you choose. You know, you you know when is the right time for you to speak up. Um, you will know. Okay, so we have intuition. Hmm. If you're reading this, your third eye is opening, waking up. Your third eye is your mystical eye, seeing all from a loving perspective. Your physical eyes see conditionally in duality, and your spiritual eye sees unconditionally in oneness, seeing into places that your physical eye cannot, into the heart of all. Bring all three eyes together to see anything in a fully balanced view. See into your own heart and see the beauty that is your essence. See beyond the fear and the limitations and open yourself to the possibility that all things are possible. From this place, you will see further, higher, and deeper. 
Capricorn, if this reading did not resonate with you, you can also watch your moon, your rising, your Venus, and your Jupiter. Bye-bye. Bye, Capricorn. Bye.